Hey boys and girls, Squee913 here. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. We just got back from rescuing Mr. Cuddles and Caden. Uh, we set up all our loot, put up our boots for the night, and got some good rest. A whole hour's worth. Look at that. That lazy drunken bear. Dude, clean up after yourself. Honestly. And now we are going to... What? Oh, right, right. I was going to see... Someone told me I had magazines that would uh, upgrade my science enough to go to... Yeah, the Programmer's Digest. Which would give me plus 30. What is my science skill right now? Uh, 28. So that would give me 58. Oh. Um... Because someone said that I would be able to break into Mr. House's computer because I had enough magazines to do it. And if that's the case, that's awesome. I really want to break into his computer. So we're going to go back to the house and out, house and out, H&R, whatever, H&H tools. <laughs> and see if I can break into Mr. House's computer. Because I really want to see what it says. Hey Cass, good morning. You're up already. Good for you. Follow me. Let's roll out then. Yes, let's do that. Let's get ammo first, shall we? Five, five point five point five six rounds. Uh, let's get armor piercing. Why not? Because I don't have many rounds for the other type. Uh, I don't need forty four magnum, but I do need this. All right. Uh, I don't need electron parge. Don't need those explosives. Do I need explosives? No, I don't need explosives. Uh, what else do I need? 50 mg? Do I have anything that uses that? I don't think so. Items. Weapons. Uh, sniper rifle uses 308. Riot shotgun uses 12 gauge. Marksman carbon uses 5.56. It'll switch you to ammo to armor piercing. There. Um, I need more 5.56 ammo. Brush gun uses that. Blade of the East uses no ammo! <laughs> Alright, so I don't need 5 milligram. Whatever. I don't need that either. I don't need 9 millimeter rounds. I need 12 gauge shotgun shells. Man, I need more 12 gauge. Because Cass and I are both using that. 20 gauge, 308 rounds. I need those. Alright. Just take all. And then I need 12 millimeter rounds. Oh, nice. Okay. What am I doing? Why didn't I take those? Alright. I think uh, I think that's it. I think we're good to go now. Ugh. Alright. Um all right, let's go. Let's hit the road. Let's go back to H&H &H Tools, huh? You're following me, right, Cass? You are following me, right? Cass? I told you to follow. Here, girl. Come on. do 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 Anyway, if for some of you guys, if you're thinking that I'm stopping recording quite a bit, I am a little bit because someone will say something interesting on Ustream and I have to find out what the heck they're saying. So I do pause it a little bit. H&H uh, right, &H Tools is over here. Do, 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 do. You know, we don't see many robots like this in the game. Well, where, where's my mouse? That guy, the, guy, the robot behind the guy. You don't see many robots like that in this game. I haven't run into any yet, that I know of. And I know if I would run into him. 
I guess. Caravan of two now. Yes, we are. You sound like you're enjoying that a lot more. All right. House full of dead robots. It's awesome. Alright, let's see if we can't crack this computer, shall we? I can! I can crack it! I can crack it, folks! Isn't that awesome? Alright, uh... Items. Aid. You know what, let's, uh... I was gonna save this, but no, I'm not gonna metagame it where, well, if it's not good, I'll still keep my magazines. No, screw that. I'm, I'm sacrificing my magazines to find out what the heck is on his computer. Actually, you know what? I'm still going to save it because I don't know if, uh, if it's an accumulative effect. I've never actually tried. I think it is. I think I've tried. I don't know. Uh, okay. I don't have a computer skill of 50? Really? Didn't I just... It only works once. Darn it! Well, it's a good thing I auto-saved, huh? Oh well. Load. So I can't get into his computer. And that sucks. Oh well. I really want to know what it says. Maybe later. No, because I won't have... I'm not going to build up my science. <laughs> when am I ever going to do that? Oh well, I shall forever be in the dark of what Mrs. House's computer said. I, I'm all, I only have like nine levels left, so I have to start being really careful about where I assign my points. Alright, well, this was a wasted trip. What do we do now? Um, let's go back to Freeside. Why not? Status? No, data. Let's go to Freeside. Uh, I mean, there's tons of stuff I'm supposed to do in there. Plus, there's that building I still need to go... The, the it was that other caravan company that there might still be some loot in there. Uh, there's Novak, and you know the whole main quest line thing. But pff, pff, <laughs> since when have I been caring about that? I had a crusade to go take care of. Please, some human shoot me in the head. Small potatoes compared to evil robots. All right. Uh. No, guys, I will do the main quest. I'm just not really in a hurry. Right, let's go try and find that building first. Who's this guy? Hey. Wow, you look messy. <laughs> Perhaps you should bathe. Whoa, 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 whoa. Nice job, Cass. Damn, darling. I am glad you're on my side. All right, then. That's what you get. Where's that building? I don't think it's over here. What is over here? Let's explore, shall we? We are explorers. Boldly going where no uh, courier has gone before, except for the other ones that went here already. Hey, there's boxes here. Ammo boxes. Sweet. Wow, there's lots of stuff here for the taking. It's not owned by anyone. That's awesome. Alright. 
right? Uh, 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 let's see. Uh, I really don't really know what to do, folks. I mean, the past couple episodes, I had such focus. I had such determination. I had a goal. I knew what I was doing. And now I'm just kind of... Ugh. I mean, not, not that I'm not enjoying myself. I just don't know where to go. Let's talk to Dixon. Let's see if he says anything interesting. For a fix, man? I got what you need. Do you have stim packs? Is that the kind of fix? Have a look, baby. I am not your baby. Do not say that. Whiskey? Dixon's whiskey. What's the difference? It's not as good. <laughs> Alright. You got nothing I want, sir. See ya. Do, 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 do. What is this? Is this like a store? It's got dinosaurs in it. Look at steel dinosaurs. A washing machine. It's a washateria. Huh. You're looking for guns, talk to me. Otherwise, I've got a nice selection of general supply. Sure. What do you have in stock? Take a gander. I will, sir. I will take a gander. Ah, let's see. Uh, duct tape. Oh, teddy bears. Four of them. Oh, sweet. <laughs> oh, no, one. One teddy bear for four caps. Whatever. Alright, that was worth it. Except. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Uh, do you offer any other services? I only offer services if the king gives the okay. Press him and we can talk. Okay. A resourceful fellow such as yourself must have something on the side. Alright. Yeah, I've got a little side business going. What I'm about to share with you does not leave this room, eh? Of course not. Over the years, I've gradually perfected my craft to the point of perfection. No one can distinguish between my work and the real thing. What? What I'm referring to... Macaroni and cheese? Oh, passports. I can whip up a strip passport which will fool even the most well-trained eye. Ooh. Ah, now I see why you want me to keep this low key. Hey, if you're interested and have the caps, they go for 500. Any less and it ain't worth the risk of getting caught. What do you say? You game? Uh Have they got enough caps to pass the credit check? No, sure. I, sure. I don't want to spend money. Yeah, someone told me I had to spend a lot of caps to get into the strip. I don't want to spend a lot of caps. So, sure. 500 caps. Here you go. Thank you. Uh, the followers are looking to set up a supply deal. We don't have the stills and equipment to supply the amount of meds they're looking to purchase. You could check with other wasteland merchants, but I think your best bet would be the Atomic Wrangler. Where's that? It's got a bunch of stills and a seemingly endless supply of grain alcohol, which could be used as anesthetic or disinfectant. Alright, I'd like to know more about Freeside. What do you want to know? Uh, who is the king? If you haven't heard of the king, you must have been living under a rock or something. Or shot in the head. The king has his boys all over Freeside. He controls the water pump and is essentially the go-to guy for what goes around here. Alright, who are the Van Graffs? They're the local energy weapon dealers in Freeside. When it comes to lasers and plasma, they're the only game in town. <laughs> Not anymore. Gloria's men are the best armed in Freeside and ruthless to boot. But her brother, Jean Baptiste Cutting, puts them all to shame. Not anymore, he doesn't. <laughs> they're dead. Alright, what's up with the Atomic Wrangler? Their joint is the only place in Freeside to get it all under one roof. Got gambling, booze, chems, and whores. They're good folks, just don't cross them. They're known for tidying up loose ends with a bullet to the brain box. Hey, I've been there before. I've had a bullet to the brain box. I, I will not mess with them then. Let's talk about something else. Anything else I can help you with? Cool, I can get into the strip now. Which Come back anytime. I don't have an interest in doing at the moment, All but... Traveling's making me thirsty. You have whiskey! Stop complaining! I will want to get in there at some point, so it'll be nice to have that uh, forged pass, assuming it works. 
Hey there, Mick. Welcome to Mick and Ralph's. If you need guns, I'm your man. Good, because I need guns. Supplies and other services. See my partner Ralph. I need guns. What guns do you have for sale? Have a look. Uh Let's do weapons. Don't need ten mil pistols, don't need brass knuckles, dynamite, hunting rifle, pull cue, shotguns, spiked knuckles, ooh. Throwing hatchet, throwing knife. Don't need those. What else we got here? Apparel. Desperado cowboy hat. I could use that to repair my cowboy hat. <laughs> uh, naughty nightwear. Ooh. Old cowboy hat. Alright, what else we got? Cram, don't need cram. What about in the way of ammo? 3 or 8 rounds. I think I'm good on 3 or 8 rounds, aren't I? Yeah, I'm good for now. Arm piercing hollow point. 40. Da, 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 da. Oh, I ain't got tons of that for now. Uh, 12 gauge. Oh, yes, I need those. Lots of those. Give me those. Yeah, give me that too. Uh, 12 millimeter, 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 millimeter. I think I have plenty of those. Uh, let's get that. Okay, I think we're good. Nice. So now I'll have some more 12 gauge. That should hold me over for a while. Me thinks. Alright, uh. The people on Ustream are telling me that Mick might have more stuff. He's holding out on me. Uh. Do you have any special items for sale? Why? You work for one of the casinos? Uh. Speech 30, no. In that case, yes I do. Follow me. Oh, nice. <laughs> wow! Awesome! Like I always say, a polite society is an armed society. Nice. Alright. Let's see what you have now. <laughs> uh. Oh, he has more C4. Need C4 at the moment. Grenade machine gun. Oh, that's like Mercy. I already have Mercy. Don't need you guys. <laughs> Hunting rifle, long fuse dynamite, plasma, power fist, power fist, pulse grenade. Oh, pulse grenades. Need those. Uh, spike missile, straight razor, switchblade, tire iron. Ooh. So you did have more stuff. You naughty man, you. Alright, uh. Right. Apparel. Don't need that. Cram. Ammo. I think I'm good on ammo, really. Okay. Well, thank you. No, 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 no. Don't cancel transaction. That was fun. <laughs> wow. Look at you. What is that? Oh, it's like a big machine gun, huh? Well, good job. You guys were a nice store. Pleasure doing business with you. Let's go find the Atomic Wranglers, huh? Oh, no, 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 wait. I have more stuff to talk to him about. And Cass is like, well, make up your mind. Welcome back. Uh, how's business? Things were better when the Omertas were buying, but we did buy. Van Graff's getting killed is making a mess of things, but we have other customers. Oh, I didn't mean to cause problems for you. I just meant to murder them all. What's the deal with the uh, Martas? Or Murtas? That's the thing. I have no idea. They just stopped buying guns all of a sudden. If you hear anything, let me know. Will do. Anything else I can help you with? Um... Can you repair some things for me? Sure. Let's see what you've got. Uh, riot shotgun. 631 caps. 9mm pistol. Don't need that repaired. Sniper rifle. I could definitely have that repaired. I definitely need that repaired. Repair all. 
only 3,000 caps. Uh, yeah, I don't need that repaired though. All right, we'll do that. I don't need the nine millimeter repaired, so that's fine. God, there goes all my caps again. <laughs> oh well. Um, the followers are looking to work out a supply deal. Are they looking to buy guns? No. <laughs> then talk to my partner, Ralph. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, that was pretty stupid of me, actually. <laughs> are they looking to buy guns? No. Then why are you talking to me? Do you not see the massive amount of guns behind me? <laughs> That's what I do. I sell guns. Hey there. Hi there. Ho there. Who there? Alright, how do I, uh... Where are the Atomic Wranglers? Down here, maybe? Let's try over here. Acne reality. Okay. Lots of kids running around town, huh? No. Down here? Wow, that is not a pleasant sound. Hang on, folks. Never mind, don't hang on, don't hang on. There's people trying to shoot me. Shoot him in the head. Nice. That's what you get for attacking me with a pull cue. What's wrong with you? Alright, hang on. Okay. You know, I don't think I really need the assault car beam in the city. Let's just switch to... Uh, heck, let's just switch to the 9mm. Oh, I only have 10 rounds for it. Let's switch to the 7... The 12.7. Alright, sound like a plan. God, why is everyone screaming? What is wrong with you people? Isn't anyone in this city happy? The kings! I wonder if I should talk to them. Eh, maybe soon. Oh, I gotta go to, uh... Oh, there's the Atomic Wrangler. Hang on, I gotta go to, uh... uh the, 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 the building I gotta clear out again. It's over here, isn't it? Somewhere. Wasn't it? Welcome to the Strip, huh? Oh, I did not know that's how you get into the Strip. That's cool. Yeah, I'm gonna go explore this over here. I don't need to get into the Strip yet. Robot! A robot. I wonder if there's a way to... There's lots of robots there. Holy cow. Lots and lots of robots. piercing ammo. Alright. Cass, you come over here. You're just gonna get me in trouble. Come all the way over here. Come here. Come here, Cass. Come here, Cass. Alright. You wait here. Sitting tight. Good. You do that. You sit tight. Can I get him? Eh, let's move up a little closer, shall we? Oh, much better. Well, not much better, but whatever. Did I get him? Ah! <laughs> I killed a robot. 
I know there's a pulse gun, but I don't want to use it because I'm trying to be quiet about this. Alright. Another robot. Oh, it's only 13% chance. I need to get closer. What about him? One of my chances. 18. That's good enough for me. That's two down. <laughs> oh, man. Let's see if I can just get him. Yes! I got all three, and they never even knew I was here. Stinking robots. Who's this guy? You look new to Freeside, so here's a little advice, friend. Don't go past the Southgate greeter without talking to it first. The what? Uh, why wouldn't I want to go past this greeter? Those bots are programmed to vaporize anyone who enters the fenced-in area without authorization from the greeter. It doesn't look like they're going to be doing a lot of vaporizing now, does it? Thanks for the advice. Who are you? The name's Old Ben. I've been living in Freeside since the day I was born. What's your story? I've done a bit of everything around here. Courier, butcher, crier, escort, gun for hire. Some of which I'm not proud of, but I do my best to help around town when needed. Courier? I used to be a courier before I got shot in the head. Exactly one of the reasons I got out of that job. Too many shifty characters looking to have someone else move their hot items. Butcher? How did you get into that? My father ran a butcher shop here in town. But business went downhill when another vendor started selling this strange meat at half our prices. Oh, that sounds... not good. <laughs> You're telling me. Not long after my father's shop went under, and he passed away from the loss, people around town started experiencing shakes. That's... No one gets shakes like that unless they're eating human flesh. But no one would believe me. The sick bastard gradually went insane and passed away. It wasn't long before someone moved into the guy's place and found half-buried human remains in the crawl space. I didn't bother saying, told you so. Huh. I don't remember why, but there's something about human flesh that gives you the shakes. I don't remember what it is, but it's creepy. Alright, uh, Cryer, what was that job? After a while, I made enough money to get a passport into Vegas. Back then, you could get approved for entry for a fraction of what it costs now. Well, I got a job working as a crier outside of the tops, advertising for the local talent performing at the casino. That didn't last long. What happened? Well, being a suave young guy, I chatted up the ladies from time to time, and one of the manager's girls started to take a liking to me. I never touched the woman, but the jealous prick decided it was my time to go. He framed me by saying I'd stolen from the casino. <laughs> sure enough, a few grand was missing from the casino vault. I have to assume the bastard stole the funds and figured I was a convenient fall guy. Ah, uh, wrong place at the wrong time if you ask me. No, that's horrible. Yeah, but what can you do? I was stripped of my casino apartment and all of my belongings and booted back into Freeside. From there, I didn't have a lot of career options as my rep was destroyed. So the escort job sort of fell into my lap. No pun intended. I use an escort like armed guard. Well, I suppose you could look at it that way, but I was packing a whole different kind of heat. No, escort just sounds better than man whore. Uh, you got paid for sex? <laughs> yep. I was damn good at my job, too. But after a while, I just felt like a piece of meat and had to quit. <laughs> after a while? So what, you enjoyed it at first? Gun for hire. When I quit the escort job, I had enough money to buy a pistol belt and some other gear. Bodyguards make a good, honest living, and I had the wits and physical build to handle most thugs. After saving a few tourists from trouble, I got a reputation for being a stand-up guy again, and after a decade, managed to save up enough to retire. Alright, let's talk about something else. Alright. Goodbye. Yep. Did you notice all the dead robots over there? Gee, I wonder who did that. <laughs> Alright, folks, let's go ahead and end this episode here for now. I'd like to thank you all for watching and join me next time. Take care.